um, Ambassador of Kenya to the People's uh, Republic of China. This afternoon, uh, uh, we listened uh, to a very powerful Kenya presentation uh, by the chairman of the Kenya bidding team, uh, Mr. Moreu. Uh, I think it was very informative, it was very captivating, and I think uh, the Kenya team has done a very good job. The mood I could tell from the room uh, was uh, positive, uh, there was a lot of uh, energy, and of course, uh, because there are very many uh, elements to the Kenyan bid, there is a bit of the business, uh, there is also the bit of uh, culture and tourism, so it was very exciting, and I could tell the, the mood in the room was warm and exciting. I'm the national chairman of the Kenya National Chamber of Commerce and Industry, as well as the Vice Chairman of the World Chamber Federation representing the continent of Africa. Um, Kenya today has had the unique privilege and opportunity to present a very powerful bid on behalf of, of um, our, our continent to host the World Chamber Congress in 2021. Uh, I believe we've put our best foot forward. Uh, we have had the support of several agencies of government and from the private sector. We've been endorsed by all the leading corporates in Kenya. And today in Beijing, I'm accompanied by a delegation of 14, including our, uh, His Excellency, the Ambassador of, Ch of Kenya, uh, to China. We've also got a uh, very strong t representation from the Kenyatta Conference Center and the Kenya Investment Authority. So we believe that we have put in our bid and the voting that begins in May the 24th, uh, Kenya has a very good opportunity to demonstrate once again um, its capability to host a major international conference. The mood in the, in the room was uh, very bullish and uh, I think uh, it is agreed that the, con that the conf conference will be in our region. Um, I would believe that maybe our strongest competitor may be Dubai. But again, we have a very, very good opportunity to be uh, the winners. It's Maru, I'm the chairman of the Kenya uh, Bid Committee. And I came in about three, two days ago um, uh, to come and present uh, our bid here. It's been a, a terrible waiting time. Uh, there's four of us who are bidding and we were slotted to bid number three. Uh, and we've just, we've just done that. And I think we've, I, I did my best. And if my best is good enough, then I can tell you we've nailed it and uh, we should have this bit coming home. How's the mood in the From the questions that were asked, it, it's clear the, the, the direction they're looking at. And I feel, I feel we've convinced them that we're not just giving them concrete jungle, we're giving them an experience of Africa. And I think for me that is the selling point, that it's, not, it's going to be a Congress like no other. We wanted it to coincide with the, with the wilderness migration. There's a bit of reservation about that date, but that's not cast on stone. We are sure that we have given our best. And if our best is not good enough, well, may the best person win. But I think we have, we have nailed it as far as I'm concerned. My name is Nana Gishaga, and I'm CEO of KICC. And we're in Beijing, China, at the World Conference. And we're in Beijing, China, at the WFC bid. Does KICC have the capacity? Yes, we do. We are a world-class venue with large meeting rooms and also outside and breakout rooms. We look forward to hosting the chambers. The reason being, it's for the economy. Africa has been skipped over many times for this bid and we're hoping that this year that we'll be able to successfully get that bid. What does it mean for Kenya? It means economic growth, it means expansion, and it also means for the delegates, they'll be able to experience what Kenya has to offer, which I think is the most important, because as KICC, we fall under the tourism sector. So not only will the delegates be coming for a conference, they will also be able to do pre and post packaging, where they'll be able to travel to our various game parks, our white beaches, and also see and visit the city and the 24-hour economy that we have now created.